from the outermost edges of space. Well, hey everyone, welcome back to Is It Worth Buying? Today we're going to be taking a look at a game called Devo, or Devo? Devo? Well, whatever it's called. Anyhow, um, basically it's a platformer game, an indie platformer that was just released about uh, a day or so ago, I think? At least a day ago, uh, ago but anyway. Um, I actually played a, a demo of this on Steam. Unfortunately, uh, Steam looks like they've taken it off since then, um, so the demo's no longer available through them. However, I found it on a different server, so I'm going to link you to that, basically, so that you can play the demo. Uh, there's about five levels in the demo, and in the full release, there's about 25. So about each level is about 25 cents because the game is about five bucks. Uh, if you look at each level being worth, you know, a, a certain value. Anyhow, um, let's just get started with the game because I kind of want to show you uh, what it's like to play it. So um, I'm going to go ahead and get started with that. We'll do a new game and start. Oh. Right there. There we go. And then it's going to basically load a little storyboard. Um, since this is from an indie developer, obviously, I mean, they didn't have, you know, a ton of money to put into, like, a video intro. Which, I mean, I'm not complaining, honestly. I really like these little pictures that they're using. Because each little picture tells a little bit of the story, basically, until they get to the end picture, where, which is where you are, basically. Um, and it's a really, really uh, neat platformer, as you'll see here shortly. All right, ready for level one. All right, so let's start collecting stuff. Uh, one thing to note immediately um, is that this will has a magnetic mode, which I'm gonna enable right now to show you what it's like. So I'm gonna hit that, and you know, as you'll notice, the will changes color. Um, and now I can actually go under the platform I was just on. Um, and then if I disenable it again, then I can detach myself from there and we can jump. Now we want to avoid the enemies like the one that's up ahead. Oh, nope, I didn't. If you look at my energy up bar up top, you'll notice that went down because of coming in contact with the enemy. And then we're just gonna move up. Oh, no, didn't quite make it. Let's try that again. Yay. Teleport to another section of the map here. Right now I'm just trying to speed run through. I'm not trying to collect everything. Uh, if you play the demo, uh, you can go ahead and do that. But I'm just I just want to see if I can get to the end before the time runs out. All right, we'll enable the magnetic mode from here. And I'm going to wait until that elevator comes down. Let's see here. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, well, hey, at least it gave me a little bit more time. Let's follow that back up. Then we wait. <laughs> All right, jump. Ah. All right, let's try not to mess this up this time. Okay, so long as he doesn't fall off the edge of that, we'll be fine. So far, so good. So try to avoid the enemy. We did. Hey, we actually made it to the end of the level. Still have some time left. I just want to complete it though. With each um, item that we collect, we get a little bit more bonus. Um, so, um, depending on, of course, on the item, I think the uh, there's a particular part I'll show you here on the next level. So let's go to the next one and wait for it to load. All right. I really like the music for this game. That's the other thing. It's like it's very upbeat and it's like it it's so much fun to listen to. I mean. That's, that makes a big part for it, especially being an indie game. I mean, I love indie games, but this is some of the best music I've heard in an indie game. It's just, besides it being upbeat, I don't know, it's just, I really, really like it. Alright, let's get over here to the elevator. Again, I'm not trying to collect everything, so that's why you'll notice... Oh! Hopefully I don't run out of energy before I get to the top here. All right, let's see if we can avoid the enemy there, which we did. And go up. Yay. Ooh. 
Let's see if I can... Oh, oh, no, no, no! Ah! Yay! Magnetic mode saved me. Oh! Well, it would have if I hadn't fallen down myself. Let's see if we... Oh, boy. This is not looking good. I may... Oh! There went some more energy. Let's try that again. Excellent. Alright, let's take this up. And oh. Oh. Ah. Bummer. Well, let's see if I can get through it. <laughs> At least I know the general area where the uh they're gonna be in. Oh. <laughs> now I'm gonna have to wait for the elevator to come back. Come on. And there we go. All right. Now let's see. I don't want to. Yes, I don't want to hit you. All right. Let's see here. Let's see what I can do about avoiding that. Ride that up. Oh, that was close. Almost went off the edge. And across we go. All right. Engage. And yes, made it over him. Looks like I have a wrench icon there, which I'm not gonna need actually, since I didn't damage my little wheel this time. Let's go in there. And wait to be spawned up here. All right, oh, another elevator. This one's automatic, it looks like, though. All right, we'll wait for that. Excellent. I always feel like I'm gonna fall off the edge. <laughs> Don't know why, though. All right. Here we go, and jump. Oh, okay, and jump again. All right, let's see here. Ah! Oh, wow, that took away three. Well, hey, at least I made it to the end of the level this time. <laughs> Yay! All right. Well, I didn't do quite as good as last level, but made it through. All right, let's do one more level here so we can get an idea of what it's going to be like. If you can't tell, I really like this game. <laughs> it's like, uh, I've been waiting for this to come out after I played the demo. Let me think. It's been probably, I would say at least four to six months since I played the demo for this game. Um, and absolutely loved it. Uh, at the time, I didn't think about doing a review. By the way, I just clicked the key card there. That's what I came up here for. And I'm gonna go back, oh, down this direction. And that just opened up a door over here. Um, but yeah, I thoroughly love the demo. And uh, the creator of the game looks like he's, oh. Um, has definitely improved the mechanics of the game. And then that, that just made me me though, because I, um, I remember having difficulty getting around the level before, but that, like I said, that could have just been that I wasn't used to the way that this game plays. Ah, don't want to hit them. Go away. Go away. Give me enough room to jump. Thank you. Ah, still ended up hitting you. All right. Let's see here. We got four or five more energy to go. So we're doing good. Ooh, we need another key card for this door. All right. I did not want to teleport, but okay. Let's go back up. All right, and okay. Now we now we wait. So far, so good. Grab the elevator up. Going up. And out we go. All right. Oh, looks like they already got another key card. Yay! <laughs> I'm gonna need to jump on this one. Just slightly. Woohoo! Alright, and hop on. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, man, that was not good. Hey, at least it teleports me back here. Woohoo! All right, let's see if I can make it through this level without dying. 
Because I only got three energy left to make it, and I'm about a minute left. All right. Magnetic mode up this direction. Oh, almost didn't make it there. Wait for that to go through. Woo, that was close. Jump again. Aha, made it. Woo. All right. Well, that's the first three levels of the game. I don't really want to spoil the rest of the game for you because it's just, it's a lot of fun to play. Um, and like I said, you can download the demo uh, from the link that I'll provide. And that'll give you access to at least the first five. So you can get a... a very good idea of what it's like to play the game. All right, let's just head back to the main menu now. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this review of Divo, Devo, Devo, Divo? Well, whatever it's called. <laughs> um, it was a lot of fun showing it to you. Uh, it's just, I like it. It's a little bit different than other platformers where you have, like, your, where you can hang on to stuff um, with the magnetic mode. The guy definitely uh, was trying to be very creative with the way he designed it. And I'm sure that there are there's other stuff later in the game, honestly. I'm guessing, because um, I wouldn't think that he would repeat something of that type. Anyhow, uh, I hope you enjoyed watching today's review. Thanks, as always, for watching. And remember, go out there and have fun. Have a wonderful day, everybody. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you'd like to help me improve or have ideas for future videos, leave it in the comments below or send it to techandtextproductions at gmail.com.